We need to save it. Right. Okay. Next up, then, the strenuous system. Good timing, Commander. We got oh. a transmission coming in from the Citadel. Top priority clearance. The Citadel? Who's it from? Is it the Ambassador? It's not his signature. I think it's from the Council. I'll patch it through to the Comrade. Okay, did not expect that. So we're not going to Strenuous just yet. Just trying to get the hell off Novaria. We haven't even done it yet. Commander Shepard, we've received information that may be critical to your mission against Saren. Excellent. I'll take all the help I can get. We've received an urgent message from one of our infiltration regiments in the Traverse. Okay, go ahead. I'm listening. We currently have several infiltration units scattered throughout the border regions of Citadel space. This particular unit was gathering intel on Saren. Yeah, what the hell? My whole mission is stop Saren, and you're not informing me that you have people out there trying to gather intel? I would want to get first-hand contact with those people. Direct contact. Ugh. I don't like being kept in the dark. We can't have you racing around the galaxy chasing false leads, Commander. We only contacted you because we feel this may be significant. Unfortunately, the message we received was little more than static. The infiltration team must be in a situation where they can't set up proper interstellar communications. But the message was sent on a channel reserved for mission-critical communications. Whatever they were trying to tell us, we know it was important. Considering your interest in Saren, we thought you might want to investigate this. Find out what happened to our team. The signal originated from the planet Vermeer. Vermeer. All right, well, I understand. I'll look into it. The Council prefers not to become involved in the specifics of Spectre activities. We only want you to be aware of all your options, including Vermeer. Good luck, Commander Shepard. We will keep you advised if we learn anything else. Hmm. All right, well, we know now that Vermeer is a potential target. I think, though, that given that they said, you know, they don't want us chasing down false leads... Um, Pharos should probably still be the priority for the main mission here. Uh, now Navigator Presley's up in the air. What the hell's going on here? Mass effect fields are all wonky in this ship all of a sudden. We'll have to have Engineer Adams take a look at it. And he's up there still. Okay, fine. Right, in the hell off the ice pit that is Novaria. To the strenuous system. We're in the pipe, five by five. Commander, urgent message from Alliance Command coming in. I'll patch it through. Oh, for God's sake. Shepard, this is Admiral Hackett from Alliance Command. We've got a situation here, and you're the only one that can handle it. What's the matter? What do you need, Admiral? There's an Alliance training ground where we test weapons and technology and live fire simulations. One of the VIs we use to simulate enemy tactics in the drills is no longer responding to our override commands. It's gone rogue. Rogue, sir? Are you telling me this computer is thinking on its own? We're not stupid, Shepard. This is a virtual intelligence, not a true AI. It's not self-aware, and it can't access any external systems. We didn't do anything illegal here. Virtual intelligence support is critical to our military success. VIs process thousands of status reports and react in nanoseconds. No human can do that. We need you to fight your way through the training ground of the VI Corps. And manually disable it. Hmm. Sounded a little defensive there, Admiral Hackett. All right, we'll take care of it. Don't worry, Admiral. I'll take that thing out. I know Spectre's answer the council, but you're still human. You're still part of the Alliance military, and right now we need you. The VI controls all the facilities, weapons, drones, and automated defenses. You're the only one that can pull this off, Shepard. Good luck. Yeah, uh, I, in my opinion, uh, while I answer to the Citadel Council, I'm, I'm, I'm both. I'm a Spectre and I'm Alliance military. So the military didn't, the Alliance didn't uh, discharge me or anything. So don't 
know why he would have to remind me of that. Okay, wait, what was the planet? I think this one, right? Nope, not this one. Zawin? Yes, Zawin. Once again, Zawin has a thin atmosphere of... Oh, we can't land here. What the hell? The journal said to go to the strenuous system, right? Trellin, that was it. No. What the... But... They're supposed to be... Hang on a second. They're supposed to be... Uh, is it too late? Rogue VI. Missing person. Go to the strenuous system in the Horsehead Nebula and uh, cluster and search for signs of Garroth's brother and his ship. Soul system will cluster. Be with the rogue VI on Earth's moon. My god. He didn't mention it was on the freaking moon. That's important. Uh, okay. So, what the hell? We're in the strenuous system, are we not? All right. Let's start at the beginning. Okay, we've already read these, so I'm not going to read them, but I am going to visit each one and make sure that I'm not missing something. Trellin does not have anything. Um... Zawin looks like it should have something. But we can't land here. This may be a this may not be a thing we can solve. Maybe it's something bugged out. Maybe I should not have come here before I went to Novaria. I don't know. Or maybe I need to actually like scan the whole place. Gonna run the cursor over the solar system. Make sure there's not like a ship out in the middle of nowhere that I'm missing or something. So did say to, did say to look for his ship. I don't know. I think something may have bugged out because that planet Zawin or whatever it is sure looks like it should be visited. sure you guys probably already know. I hope that it's not something I'm screwing up. Yeah, we couldn't land on this the first time we visited it either, which again is a little weird. Even if we haven't initiated the quest, you would still think that we would be able to land on it. Oh well, I guess we're not going to the strenuous system then. So then, uh, oof, okay, wait, so then what's our next priority? <laughs> okay, sorry you guys, I swear we'll go someplace. Um, missing person, we can't do that one. Cerberus, Yangtze system in the Voyager cluster. Right, Voyager cluster then is the next priority. Cluster, Argos Row, Artemis Tau, Voyager Cluster. Okay. Mm, let's check out the Amazon system first. Signal from Fifth Fleet HQ on the Citadel. Oh, for God's sake. Shepard, something uncomfortable has just come up. In the first contact war, we fired a lot of espionage probes into Turian space. We just received a mission complete burst from one of them. <laughs> huh. Okay. It's a bit of a delay, but I guess that makes sense when you're talking about the 
galactic scale of things, you know. Where's it been in the meantime? No idea. Lost in transit. These probes were built in a hurry after first contact. All right. What makes this uncomfortable? When these probes were launched, we didn't have any idea who we were fighting. We didn't want to risk aliens examining our technology. The probe has a demo nuke built in. A 20 kiloton tactical fusion warhead. 20 About kilotons? The bomb dropped on Hiroshima back in the Was that really necessary? If somebody finds that probe, tampers with it. You don't need me to finish, Commander. That's fucked up. I could understand in a get smart kind of, you know, this message will self-destruct or uh, Mission Impossible or something like that. I could understand putting some kind of explosive in the probe that would destroy it if somebody were to come into contact with it that we didn't want them to get their hands on it. But a freaking nuclear bomb like Fat Man or Little Boy? That powerful? What the hell? Unless your goal was to destroy the enemy when they encountered the probe, but then that's incredibly short-sighted because certainly there are going to be probes you won't recover, and then they'll be floating out in space for some innocent party to come across and blow the shit out of themselves. Ah, that's just crazy. This is nuts. I understand this must be handled, but I don't have anyone trained to deal with this sort of thing, sir. I know. I wouldn't ask if it wasn't important. These probes have been classified for 26 years. The Council will call fusion bomb booby traps dangerous and irresponsible. The Alliance would face censure if they find this probe. I'm asking you because the Normandy can get on site quickly and quietly. It's in the Voyager cluster. Uh... I don't know why I would say it shouldn't be over there. Surely there are other probes out there like this that, you know, we didn't hear from all of them except this one. We certainly have other ones still out there flying around somewhere. I wonder why we're not so worried about those. Maybe because we can't locate them, I guess. But still, that speaks badly of the Alliance. That they're only freaking out because one of them has tried, has sent a message. There's still other probes out there, and they're not making effort, any effort to uh, recover them or protect people from them. Alright, where's it at? We'll get on it immediately, Admiral. And we'll be discreet. I appreciate that, Commander. Good luck. Fifth fleet out. Ugh. Weird. Well, that's military brass for you. Oh. Uh. Ajibinium. Ajibinium is a small terrestrial world with an extremely thin atmosphere of carbon dioxide and krypton. Though the planet has sufficient mass to maintain a much thicker atmosphere, much of it has been blasted away. The red giant Amazon is a long period variable star currently at the nadir of a, the, na, is it nadir or nadir? I think it's nadir, of a 16 year cycle. At peak, its energy output doubles, lashing adjibinium with intense heat and radiation. The crust is mainly composed of aluminum with deposits of tin. Much of the surface is coated with fine silicate dust, which easily pre penetrates the smallest cracks to foul machinery. Hmm. Looks like we don't have any. Uh, hazards, though. Alright, let's land here, but Joker, this time, can you get a little bit closer to the surface before you drop us off, please? Um... Uh, Liara, and... Tally. No. Joker, no, wait! Wait, 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 you said you're gonna get lower into the fuck! God damn it, Joker! Fuck you! Fuck you! Okay, let's see. Oh boy, lots of flat spaces. You know what that means? Alliance homing beacon. That is probably our probe. Let's go there first. Pfft, boy. Alright. Hit me. This is an awesome planet, though. Holy crap. I don't know how you could possibly see that star field with the giant, massive star there. Surely that would black out everything else, but 
it looks fantastic. No? Okay. Thought for sure we were going to get nailed with a Thresher Moth. Hello? Now this is not what I expected. I expected to find a probe. Not a mine. Hmm. Alright, stay frosty people. In fact, Liara, you're on pistols. Tally, you're on pistols. Hmm. Maybe I should have brought Ashley. <laughs> We've the all got pistols. coming from a mine. Yeah, that's weird. A trap. It has to be. I concur. This did not crash. Someone moved it here. Uh, yeah. But doesn't change our objective. Whoever moved it is in danger, whether they are planning a trap for us or not. They may not know what they have. Let's find it before they set it off. All right, Shepard. Uh, oops, sorry guys, I'm hitting the wrong button here. But, you know what? Bringing up the mission computer reminds me that I could set up my squad. I haven't uh, gone on a mission with these two in a long time, so I might as well take advantage. Well, not take advantage. I learned my lesson, I guess, on Novaria when I went out with Garrus and Rex and fought a few bad guys before I even uh, gave them all their possible points. Advance throw. A few points in the lift. A few into singularity. A few into electronics. One more into scientist. Um, hmm. Advanced first aid and advanced overload. And then tally. Let's unlock shotguns, but I'm not going to give you any skill in it. I'd rather you stick with pistols. Advanced marksman. Advanced shield boost. I think I can just do... I don't have to click on each one individually. I think I can just click on the level I want to get it to. Like that. Oh. Okay, I still have to click multiple times. Fine. Uh, advanced damping. 100 damage in an 8 meter radius. Enemies cannot use biotic tech abilities for a short period. Stuns most enemies for 3 seconds. Let's get that. Let's increase... First aid. Okay, now let's kid everybody out. We've got all kinds of new stuff here. It's been a long time since you guys have been on a mission. Um. that and eh, take incendiary rounds no armor for you tally no armor for you no omni tool for you you are also using a pistol how about the Raikou 4 can have... all I have are combat sensors, basically. Yeah, you know what, just stick with the high caliber barrel. Armor piercing rounds, let's go to... You can also use incendiary. Let's just roast everything that comes near us. Okay, that's good. 
go with that for now. Actually, let's save it. Right. Alright. Mission. Gotta do the mission. Get this bomb and shut it down. Probe bomb thing. This room is clear. Zero enemy contacts. Currently. Hmm. That could be our probe. Certainly some big goddamn thing. I know there's jokes among the Mass Effect fans about chest high walls, but seriously, who put all this shit out here? Why would you stack, why would you organize your crates like this? This room looks like it might be clear. Is this our device? No, this is... Looks like a drill, actually. Looks like a mining drill. Hmm. Okay. That one's locked. I guess this is where we go first. Alright, stay frosty everyone. I'm opening the door. We ready? The hell? Okay, I expected it to be defended. Shepard. At last. What? Elanos Haliad, who the fuck are you? You have me at a disadvantage. My name is Ilanos Heliot. I doubt you know it. Who do you think runs the Terminus clan, Shepard, huh? Thousands of pirates, slavers, criminals of every stripe? Who gives a shit? You assume I give a damn. That's cute. The strongest leads. The one who kills the most men, seizes the most ships, pillages the most colonies. Three years ago, I was the strongest. I used my influence to assemble a fleet. We would drive your kind out of the verge. What? Wait a minute. Attack Elysium. Why would I accuse him of attacking Elysium? This was three years ago, he says. Uh, I guess I'm saying nice try. I don't like this guy. You organized the attack on Elysium. Too bad we kicked your ass back into Terminus, huh? I was the motivator, the instigator, the one who promised glory and riches for sacking the largest human colony in the cluster. The one blamed when it failed. Failed! I was ruined when your kind held against the Blitz. What better way to recover my reputation than by eliminating the first human specter? This guy's voice sounds very familiar. Like, um... Almost Avery Brooks-like. I know that's probably not who it is, but... Hmm. Okay, so what's your game here, dude? I, I guess I could say Call the Normandy, but... Seriously, what's your game? I don't want to negotiate. No, just bring it, dude. We'll find a way out of here. <laughs> I rather doubt that. Goodbye, Shepard. What do we do now, Shepard? I'll goddamn kill him. We find a way out. Someone up there needs my boot up his ass. See if there's anything in here we can use. There's no time to get out. You have to disable the bomb before it goes off. Right. Manually disable hard point. Uh. Oh god. 
Oh god. We're all gonna die! Uh, what? Wait a minute. I didn't run out of time, did I? Ha! Ah, there you go. Oh shit. God damn it. Whew, okay. It's pressure. You can't handle this kind of pressure. Disabled the bomb. Take that. It, I forgot his name already. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, he has a name, I'm sure. A Elias? Not Elias. Elian Hot to Tot or something? Elian Hot to Trot. I'm coming for you, buddy. Elian Hot to Trot must die. Hmm? Oh. I figured that there was somebody down here we were going to kill, but no. This is actually the way out. Hmm? Whoa. What the crap? Can we get the Mako on remote? Well, that's weird. Ah. They took the Mako, those sons of bitch. Oh, man, if I was an infiltrator right now. Uh, unfortunately, I have all the close-range people with me. <laughs> Excluding Rex, who, of course, is also close-range, but... Okay, let's see if we can sneak down to the Mako and get it. Before these bastards realize we're here. Of course they took the Mako. That makes sense, I guess. Okay, I feel like I'm mostly out of sight. Just stay out here on the periphery. Hopefully they can't... Seems like they can't see us. I don't know why why they wouldn't be able to see us. they can't. Let's keep them in the dark. If we can. Alright, here we go. We'll just walk right up to the Mako, we'll jump in and run these bastards over. Screaming, fuck you, Elyon, hot to trot, <laughs> the whole way, because <laughs> we don't know what this guy's name is. They'd be like, no, god damn it, my name's blah 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 blah. I'm the most important pirate in the Skillian Verge, you know, whatever. Okay, well, it took me a second to realize how to shoot. That didn't help. We could just leave, that'd be kind of funny. How did I not hit them? Poof, ripping right through my shields. God damn it. Try to get a better vantage point, shall we? Can't quick save, yeah, of course not. Whoa! Whoa! Damn it! I don't know 
if that's a person over there. I think it's a crate. Oh no, it's a person. Okay, I'm shooting up onto the mountainside apparently. Still shooting up onto the mountainside. Alright, fuck this. Let's just go get him. Leroy! Oh shit! <laughs> Great time to jump up in the air, Shepard. We're gonna die. Run! Fucking run! God damn it! Holy crap, Shepard! What the hell? Okay, let's take a minute. Waste some Omnigel. Whew, that was ugly. Alright, we need some shields. Let's do donuts. Woo! Woo hoo hoo! Yeah, woo! The girls are like, Shepard, really? Just charging up the shields, ladies. Okay, well, we got like three guys left to worry about here. Of course, I'm still not hitting him. Ah, damn Mako cannon, it sucks. Let me get up on the hillside. You know, the Abrams tank can actually aim lower than the front of the tank. I think they'd have the Mako being able to do the same, given that this is a couple hundred years into the future. They keep that same functionality. Okay, we got I think one more. We see the bastard. Haliat, okay. So I thought his name was Elian Hatatrat, and it was actually something Haliat. Haliat went through a lot of trouble to draw you here. A pity it ended like this. For him and- Oh, I killed him? Ah, oh, rats. I would have liked to have uh, actually, you know, shot him in the face or something. Now that you're above ground, your suit radio has reestablished connection with the Normandy. Time to get the hell out of here. Not yet. We ain't checked shit out yet. We don't know that it's safe yet. They could just be playing possum. No, of course not, but... No, nope, there's really nothing here. Alright, Elyon, hot to trot. Burn in hell, buddy. Um, okay, I don't know why I just did that. Let's see the map, though. Right. That's where we were. That's where we are. Check out the debris and the anomaly. And then we're off this hellscape. What the? Oh, that's where we came out. Okay. Woo! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Understood. Salvage the crashed probe. Fine. It's very good, actually. No, nope, not that. That. Okay. And last but not least, an anomaly. Shepard's a bit of a redneck. He likes off-road racing. Hmm? Oh, 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 another body. Moving out. Um 
Turian insignia recovered. This body is a long way from anything and appears to have been here for quite some time. On the body is a book of drawings, including one of the Sigler outpost insignia. Alright, now, with that concluded, we are going to get the hell out of here. No, god, I keep hitting the wrong button. To the Normandy! Okay. Race against time. Find the conduit. Vermeer. Let's see. Espionage probe. Okay. Uh, well, okay. Haliot. Don't know what the guy... I forget the, what the name... I, I'm going to keep calling him Alien Hatatrot, though. I like that name better. Uh... So Cerberus, I think, is probably next, because we can't do the strenuous one. Apparently. We're in we're in the right uh system for it, I think. Right? Oh, oh, did we level up? Oh we did. Oh nice. Level 26 already. Uh let's do advanced marksman and Huh? What the hell? An advanced Throw, maybe? Hmm. Yeah, advanced throw. Okay. Right. Oh, we got codex. Yeah, let's not do codex right now, though. Let's get to... Where is it? Cerberus. Yangtze, is that where we are? Voyager cluster, yep. We gotta get to Benthu, but we'll explore the rest of the system that we're in right now first.